Yeah, tell your viewers, ladies and gentlemen, good morning, and you are welcome to the camera. In case you are just tuning on your TV set, these are live images magnetic by Fonchama Sons Photo and Video Studio beside uh, Magic Bang, Garrote Bonaberry, on the occasion of the removal of the peak remain of Mama Ambeng Christina. Born sometime in 1950 and set 2023. You are going to follow us minute by minute report. Uh, at this juncture, we find ourselves at uh, Aluchem Mochari, where we are about to collect the pig remains of Mama Amber Christine. If it happened, not to be here, we are magneting at the frontal view of Aluchem Hospital Mochari here in Douala. Yeah, we acknowledge the arrival of uh, some of the family members who are, who are already present here at the mortuary while waiting for the rest to come to collect the pig remains of Mama. Amber Christina, whose mortar remains is lying at the Luchem Hospital Mortuary right now. Stay tuned. Uh, we say we are walking or we are reporting all these images under the banner of Mr. Jerome Ngwa, who happened to be the coordinator of this program. Uh, we acknowledge his present on time here at the mortuary this morning where we're about to collect the pigmen of Mama Ambeng Christina who saw the light sometime in 1950 and passed away in 2023. You stay tuned, we are going to be giving you minute by minute report as time goes on. Stay tuned, thank you. Yeah, we are just coming out of the mortuary. With the picture made of Mama Amber and Christina. But you can see it for yourself. This is the pig remain of Mama Amber Christina lying on in this casket.
on this day so uh, all of us we know it's really a sad moment but it is also a joyful moment because our sister our mama who is lying here has died as a child of God and uh, the Bible says in such a case we not get for mourn like to, of somebody who does not have a hope and more to that our mama has been sick and was down for eight good years. So where she is now, she is no more in a wheelchair. Amen. Amen. She is no more in a wheelchair. Where she is now, she is resting. So we have a few minutes to spend here before we go to the house. And then after that, they will give us the program. But once they make, we, we give thanks to God. You know, it is the way of everybody. But we give thanks to God for what God has done. So we will sing this short song where they say, We give you all the glory. We give you all love. We give you all the glory. We give you all love. We give you all the glory. We And a season for every activity under heaven. A time to be born and a time to die. A time to plant and a time to uproot. He continues, he says, a time to kill, a time to give to life, and all that. But for verse 11, he says, He has made everything beautiful in its time. He has also set eternity in the hearts of men. Yet, 
they cannot fathom what God has done from the beginning to the end. Go we'll bow down our heads and pray. But God, we thank you for your word this morning. Uh, we thank you for Mama Christina Rede Nicoli as we do want accompany you on the final journey to rest. <coughs> I give you praise as we look on top of your word. We will help you and say your word will bring comfort to those who need it in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. So we see by the saying there is time for everything. Time for born and time for die. There is time for everything. Today, we day here on behalf of Mama Christina, on a particular season of her life, on a particular time. And one day Mama Christina will be young like me. He will even be younger. He will start as a small picking. And today don't they hear. But we see and say, God, Bible says, God make come all these things happen. And say for a time. It will be beautiful. So today we are at the time of Mama Christie's life when I time for a final journey home. All we will should done for years, so one day we will go home. One day we will get one thing or the other. Papa don't talk for you, Mama don't seek for eight years. There is a time too to be sick and there is a time too to be healed. And you bear with me, say not be the only thing when Mama don't seek for a life. Mama don't get other sickness, but God be healing. And if it please God, say by this time, now so we plan out for Mama. And by the grace of God, Mama is 73 years. We go for thank God. Now why not pastor that song and say, we will give God the glory. When I read that, Mama be blessed. Mama get eight beginning. He get 23 grand beginning. And Mama don't see third generation. With two great grand beginning. That is a blessing on Mama's side. And the Bible says that God make them so, and it be beautiful in his time. Then, verse 11 again talks, say, He has also set eternity in the hearts of men. What it means, say, wait, if you think, say, say Mama don't die, but Mama never die. Mama don't just move from another stage of life to another. One thing I want to know about ourselves. Now say the human being, man, now an eternal being. Man not to die forever. Omar talks about man not to cease. Because as Mama don't live for this stage today, Mama will go into another dimension. And this one I just say remembrance. Say so we too we will go to in that same stage one day. Hallelujah. Amen. So Mama never die. Mama is resting. Mama don't come up from this evil world with all the troubles, the sicknesses, the pain, the quarrels, the good things equally, and all those things. And Mama don't go into another realm that way. Ain't no need for die in one day. Anyway, Bible says, despite all these seasons and all this time, God will make them purposely, be be beautiful, and then God claim me with that eternity in mind. So what you are one, just remind me today. Now say, as we the cry mama, as we accompany mama, now on our own path now, we think about eternity. But I don't talk something. Mommy died as a child of God. And Bible say, when person die in the Lord, we no need for the cry. Apostle Paul said, for me to live is Christ. For me to die, not again. Hallelujah. Amen. So for Mama to die in Christ, Mama don't win. So now is there now an opportunity for you and me now for the ask our own selves, how I will die? Will I die in Christ? Where it will be again? It means that if man die outside of Christ, the person not lose. As person where he will go into eternity. Bible talk about two people where they believe in life. We we'll talk about the rich man, and they will talk about the, 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 the poor man, Lazarus, when they get wounded. And back say, as they die, the poor man will go for Abraham in Bosom, just to tell him, again, say, life not the end on earth, life will continue after that. 
But we see these two people say they will go after that, but some man will be fine and some man will be dead fine. Not before talk say for be rich man a problem, no. Or for be rich man a still no. But we discover say the way the rich man be living life, he not be benefiting at the end because he not be die in Christ. Bible say he be there for play with pain me day, gnashing of teeth. There was sorrow. So one day he begged Papa Abraham. He said, I beg Papa, just tell Lazarus, me just dip the hands to more inside water so that me drop inside my mouth. So that he even quench the death. So moments like this, in as much as one accompanying Mama, I know say it will be very emotional, but I know say it will be na mommy the desire. For say, I wish on a feet, live on our lives, and then on a die as me I die. Because one thing is certain, die will come. There is time for everything. Die na an appointment where all we must meet up to. Our days, that we may apply our hearts to wisdom. Teach us to realize the brevity of life so that we may grow in wisdom. One thing about the life I say be brief. The life on earth be brief. Just yesterday, yesterday when they born you, look at where you are today. Then you don't even know whether you will go how far. You don't even know the day you will die. But I want you to understand as we take my new hope. Reflect upon your life. No say life be brief. Hallelujah. Life be brief. Say the life be brief. Say, I feel come also and don't come back. So that I feel apply wisdom. So that I feel follow the examples of our grandmother. I feel see young people crying. And I believe that the grandmothers of Mama, that cry, that because you remember something about Mama, I show some of what's been the echo in your mind. As you be transporting this last time. I want you to reflect on those memories and pick out those things. Realize to say one day you feel end up like mama. And then apply wisdom. And the wisdom for you, if I will advise with, I say, move, make sure say we we'll die in Christ like mommy died in Christ. We determine whether you will spend your eternity in Abraham's bosom or you will spend and outside the rich man with where you beg water. Just a drop. Man will be dead all. He reached the point where he don't get anything again. And then after eternity, we know the end. That's why we need that wisdom. And I want you to talk to God. Say, Papa God, today, as I look at Mama Christina, as I look at my mother, as I look at my grandmother, all my me begin them, I'm sure my me don't tell you something I'm about life. I'm sure say my me don't tell you about Jesus. I shall say, Mommy, don't give you advices. But today I want to pray as a memory to our mother, as our last respect to you. Say, me God, give me the wisdom to live life. Because this life is free. But say, we will do like Apostle Paul, the wise man. We say, for me to live, not Christ. And for me to die, not again. To be with any but from today, help me. To be wise, the wise man will work at any hour. He will do things any hour. He will be conscious about eternity. He will be conscious about who's that way to go. Because one day, whether you like that or not, you will die. No one will be forever. But after that, there will be a judgment. And my desire, my desire for you are now. Even for the grace to understand that as Mama Christina is here now, our turn will come, and each one of us will render account before you. Father, I pray that this word help us, O oh Lord, to transform our life. Mama Christina has been a testimony for each one of us. Father, help us, O oh Lord, to follow her step in Jesus' name. Father, as we are going now to the house, may your grace go with us in Jesus' mighty name. Father, I pray that all of everything be done according to your will in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you for your grace. Thank you for everything. In Jesus' name we are praying. Amen. Amen. Amen.
And the announcement that says, when we will take, when we will take the call to the house in Cotton, we will come meet again for 5 p.m. today, for 5 p.m. for day, in order for prepare before we will go for village. So now, we are going to pass around for. I now come out of the Aluchem Hospital Mortuary where you can see the casket and this boat in this special ambulance that have been hired to render this service here. You can see for yourself. The population that have turned out to give a befitting the area to Mama is about 5,000 persons in number that has come out to give to collect the pigment of Mama. From here we will proceed to Koto, Banamusadi, where they will lay in state and uh, in the evening will keep by night we travel to Angwe Kwata of Kwata village in fact the best subdivision in the moment we can never have a vision of color. Thank you, thank you. You can see for yourself the population that have turned out to give a befitting burial to Mama here at the motor. As you can see for yourself, you can see for yourself. We are leaving the Luce Motuary at this juncture. As you can see for yourself, live images magnetic by Fun Cham and some sort of video works. This is the family compound. We have arrived at the family compound at this juncture.
We want to give thanks for all the people that we deal with me for most of it. We say there because of the time, we know we'll be able to do the doing of the cup. So we'll do it right here now. So the, the program of this afternoon at for five o'clock. So make everybody remember. Five, we will meet. <laughs>
So we want to pray for me. Those who are that we will find a seat. We will begin with prayer and then we will sing a song. You know, my mom has been at somewhere who is going to church. And I know that plenty of people are going to go to church. So we will pray, we will sing, and then we will hear the word of God. And then the program will continue to for another week before the, the, the departure of the Amen. 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 Amen.
sit down. Now we want to hear the word of God. So our pastor is going to present to us the word of God. So make everybody don't sit on down, make it listen. And I think we will, since we don't know and the fourth and francophone the day and Cameroon be bilingual, our pastor will preach for English, then Elder will interpret it to French. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. Turn for your love and turn for your right. You salute your neighbor. Turn for your love. Step for your right. Because we see being alive. You salute your neighbor. You know we are in a funeral. Oh, in order for what has gathered us here. Is the death of our mother, Mama Christina. And tonight, ce soir, I want to talk on a topic, or I want to be talking about death. Je veux parler sur le thème de la mort. And uh, the take-home message I want you to take home. Donc, le message avec lequel j'aimerais que tu rentres. Is that death is an appointment. C'est que la mort est une prière confessionnelle. They don't pray that somebody should die. Like now, like this, if I pray, and for you to answer my prayer, and for you to accept me as a pastor, I need to tell you nicely. But if I make the error, and say you shall die, you will stone me. Or before I open my eyes, there will be nobody here. But tonight we'll be talking about death. And there will be, I don't know whether there will be a wish I will make or is a prayer or is what. But tonight I want us to look at something. Hebrews 9, verse 27. He says. And as it is appointed unto men once to die. Et comme il est but after this is the judgment. Après quoi vient le jugement. And just as it is appointed for all men once to die. La même manière qu'il est réservé à tout corps de mourir une fois. And after that is judgment. Après quoi vient le jugement. So from this first, or from where we have read, the first thing we can recognize is that everybody will die to the world. Today it is Mama Christina. I don't know who will be next, but one fact is that everybody will die to the world. All men, not some men, que tout le monde, pas certaines personnes. So everybody will die. Donc il est question ici de tout le monde. Some will die young. Certains vont mourir étant jeunes. Some will die old. Certains mourront étant jeunes. Some will die rich. Certains mourront riches. But my prayer for you is that you will die old and rich. Ma prière pour toi c'est que tu meurs dans la vieillesse et dans la richesse. I say my prayer is that you will die a fulfilled man. Ma prière c'est que tu meurs comme quelqu'un. You will die satisfied. You will die happy. In the name of Jesus, yes. you cannot avoid that. Tu ne peux pas échapper à la mort. The second thing, la deuxième chose, is that death is an appointment. Alors le deuxième fait c'est que la mort c'est un rendez-vous. One, everybody will die. Tout le monde, le fait que tout le monde mourra. One, everybody will die. Tout le monde mourra une fois. Second, deuxièmement, it is an appointment. C'est un rendez-vous. The Bible says it is appointed. La Bible dit qu'il est réservé. Death is an appointment. La mort c'est un rendez-vous. Death is an appointment. La mort c'est un rendez-vous. Today we are 
Il a appointment of Mama Christina. Aujourd'hui, nous sommes venus au rendez-vous de Mama Christina. Yesterday, you were somewhere in another person's appointment. Hier, tu t'étais retrouvé au rendez-vous d'une autre. And tomorrow, we don't know who will be next. Et demain, nous ne connaissons pas qui sera. The one thing is certain is that there will be such appointment. Mais ce qui est clair, c'est que ce rendez-vous aura toujours lieu. If you have an appointment with somebody, tu as rendez-vous avec quelqu'un. Because you always have an appointment at least with one person. Parce que tu auras toujours un rendez-vous avec une autre personne ou un tiers. But when it has to do with an appointment, there are two parties. Mais quand on parle de rendez-vous, ça concerne deux parties. You on one part, toi te retrouvant d'un côté. And then with the other party, et l'autre partie. I'm talking about the appointment tonight. Le rendez-vous dont je parle ce soir, is the appointment that you have with death. C'est le rendez-vous que tu auras death avec death. Death is the other partner mort. that you will be meeting. La mort, c'est l'autre partenaire que tu pourras passer. Can you tell your neighbor death is an appointment? Tu peux dire, Please, can you tell your neighbor death is an appointment? La mort, c'est un rendez-vous. Now, one thing about this death that we are talking about. Is that you don't know when the appointment will happen? C'est que tu ne connais pas le jour où le rendez-vous aura lieu. You don't know when this appointment will happen. Je ne sais pas quand ce rendez-vous se tiendra. Now there was this man. Il y a sept ans. And death. Oh, death sent a message to you. Mais la mort lui avait envoyé un message. And told him that you are going to die. Il lui avait dit. And the man tried to negotiate with them. He long said to say and negotiate or part of the deal. And that people is that I will always let you know when I am coming to you. He said to me, "Let me just let me just come to you every time you want to go." Chaque fois que tu te retrouveras dans des endroits, il y a là somebody is dead. Chaque fois que tu apprendras que quelqu'un est mort, remember that you will die. Tu souviens toi que ton tour arrive. That is the only way I can help you. Et c'est la seule manière dont je puisse t'aider. And this man got angry. Et cet homme était mécontent. But I'm talking about was a very successful businessman. Cet homme dont je veux mentionner, c'est c'était un homme à succès. He's somebody who has been successful in life. C'est quelqu'un qui avait réussi dans la vie. He was rich and had everything. Il était riche et il avait. In fact, he was a happy man. He is a successful man. C'est un homme à réussir. And so he thought that his his experience in battling with poverty with his enemies, he will use that against them. Il a cru que les expériences qu'il avait eues de se battre contre la pauvreté, il pouvait faire usage. So his this was his idea. He said, "I will not sleep on my bed that night." He said, "I will go somewhere." So they made him a bundle, a bundle of grass. They bought a big quantity of grass. On a on a fait un bouquet de 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 feuilles de feuilles. And so when they brought the grass, he said they should tie the grass round him. He had demanded to attach the feuilles to him, so that when the when the day will come, si bien que quand la mort viendra, he will go into his room. La mort ira dans sa chambre. Will go everywhere. Ira partout ailleurs. Will look for him and will not see him. Va le chercher mais ne le trouvera pas. Some of you here as I'm talking, vous certains qui êtes assis là pendant. Some people came to your house and you told your child go and tell them that I'm not in the house. Certains visiteurs sont arrivés chez toi, tu as dit à ton avocat, dis aux visiteurs que je suis là. So you see, you are using your own wisdom to cut short appointments. Donc tu utilises ta sagesse pour écouter un rendez-vous. And to some, you came, they were knocking, you were looking at the person through the window. Et pour certains, pendant que la personne cognait, tu le regardais au travers de la And at the end, the person concluded, you are not in the house. Et à la fin, this man was trickish. Donc cet homme était en fait... Malin, merci. And so they wrapped him with grass. Et on l'a entouré de feuilles. And they kept him in the farm. Et on l'a gardé à la au champ. And they were cooking food because the following day he will come and then they will mock them. Et on était en train de préparer des festivités parce qu'ils se disaient que le lendemain quand il viendra ils vont se moquer. So finally the day of the appointment had passed. Enfin le jour du rendez-vous est passé. And early in the morning. Et très tôt le matin. So the people went down to. Remove him from where they tied him. The gens sont partis l'enlever là où on l'avait attaché. And when they went and unbundled that bundle, the guys sont partis détacher ce fagot là. The man only fell on the ground. L'homme est simplement tombé par terre. The man only fell on the ground. Il est tombé. That is an appointment you cannot miss. La mort c'est un rendez-vous que tu ne saurais échapper. 
There is an appointment you cannot escape. La mort est un rendez-vous dont tu ne peux pas échapper. And the worst of it is that you don't know when it will take you. Le pire de tout ça, c'est que tu ne sais pas quand. You don't know how it will take you. Tu ne sais pas comment elle te prendra. But tonight. I want to encourage somebody to prepare to die. Now, before we move further, I want to say that sicknesses does not kill people. How many times have you been sick? Combien de fois as-tu été dans le tube par les gens? How many times have you been involved in a car accident? Have you died? Combien de fois as-tu été dans des accidents de voiture, est-ce que tu Me es talking like this, last November I was involved in a car accident. Pendant que je vous parle en novembre du, de l'année dernière, j'étais impliqué dans ce. And the car was beyond repairs. Et le, le, le véhicule était irrécupérable. And by the grace of God, I did not have a crash on my body. Et par la grâce de Dieu, je n'ai pas eu une blessure sur mon corps. And people who saw me wondered. Et les gens qui m'ont vu se sont étonnés. Whether I was involved in the accident. Si c'est moi qui étais dans l'accident qu'ils ont vu. So it is not accident that kills people. Bon, ce n'est pas it is not even poverty. It is not even riches. It is not even your enemies. Because when it is not your time, you cannot. But what kills people is death. Lord, I am coming home. I wasted many precious years. Now I am coming home. I now repent to be as yet.
are going to use, there will be no breakdown in Jesus' name. Your training is set in the name of Jesus. Amen. As you go, the whole program is going to be a successful one in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, we declare that any harm against his family will not succeed in Jesus' name. Amen. May your angel go with them. May your angel surrender them. May your angel fight their battle in the mighty name of Jesus. Whosoever will harm them, Father, let your angel settle that problem in the mighty name of Jesus. As they are going, they will come back safely in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We cover them in with the blood of Jesus. As we declare, the road is secure. 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 In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, take care. Father, take charge of everything in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Father, in the same spirit, we pray for this wonderful people Mama Christina is keeping behind. Father, it's true tonight we have spoken about death. We pray that you will help this family to prepare for death. In the name of Jesus. That at the same time, we pray for this family that no one will die when it is not his time. That they will die on their appointed time. In the name of Jesus. We speak good health upon the family. We speak your goodness upon the family. We speak your blessings upon the family. We speak your favor upon the family. Yes, Lord. The Bible says, if a man knows the Lord in a family, that entire family is safe. Because Mama Christina knew God. You people are protected. Amen. You people are preserved. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. your enemies will come your way. Amen. In one way, they will scatter in several ways. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. may the Lord watch over you. Yes. May His countenance shine upon you. Yes. Whether you are sleeping, mm. whether you are sick, whether you are weak, whether you are strong, in whatever way and domain, May the hand of God save you. Amen. The right hand of God that is power will make way for you. Amen. The right hand of God that is power will open doors for you. Yes. In the mighty name of Jesus. Yes. Even as you accompany Mama Christina back home, may the Lord favor you. Amen. What stop others during this moment of crisis to bury their loved ones will not stop you. Amen. You will all you will see God's favor. Yes. As you travel to and flow from the village, you will see the favor of God Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. As you go back, you will be strong. Yes. You will not fall sick. Yes. They will shoot the arrows and you will return back to sender. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus, Amen. we cover that car with the blood of Jesus. Amen. We commit the drivers in the hands of God. Amen. They will lead you as the Spirit of God leads you. Yes, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. you are blessed. Amen. I say you are blessed. Amen. You are blessed. Amen. You are blessed. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Any other person that came here tonight, we speak the blessing of God over your life. Amen. It is true we have spoken about them. You shall not die before your time. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. But God will give you grace. God will give you wisdom. Amen. So that you can count your days. God will give you wisdom. So that you can prepare to die. And above all. The hand of God will see you through. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Can you put those hands together with you? Praise the Lord. So the church service has ended at this. Uh, at Presbyterian School, welcome. Ambo. Village and got married to Pa Musa Elias Ngwa of Kulabek Village. Mama Christine, uh, I was formerly called, was uh, blessed with eight children and uh, with 23 grandchildren and with 22 great-grandchildren. That is the story of our mother who is lying in front of us tonight. We say we thank her for what she did. 
We thank her for the legacy she put on her to the family. God bless her. We'll get to the next person. It's short. Oh, the hospital, you know me, see. I get pension in Corsair, Mama Christmas. You go this one. The diary for some specialists. You want go there. You missing a person with your jaws or one day. You will say, ah, are you again? I say, yes. But. So, I want to thank everybody here. We come yeah? for assist. Say, who will give fair way for number one? Not the easy. I know you believe, say, you will go soon. But say, God, I hear you, and I God, I take her. I don't get no power for Christian God. Say, why? I always say, thank you, Lord. Thank you. Say it don't happen. Not easy. Say he lost my mate. No matter say he old. No matter say they say, but I will one say me he should not hear. They say, man, he's here. But this one will go down the side and take me. Not be looking for ask God. Say why? Thank you very much. Thank you very much for everybody who come for right, for support, for pray with me. May God bless my heart. Thank you. I can afford to miss. That was a powerful message. And we believe for those of us that got ears to hear, I think we should be fine-tuning ways on how when that day comes for one of us, we should be placed at a better position. We will not waste time. Because most have been most punishments, you stay put where you are sitting, something will meet you right on your seat. DJ.
time for item 11. Time for item 11. This is time for item 11. Time for item 1-1. One, one. Sandrine! Sandrine!
The teller of the was at the church front in time we are lifting the casket up, proceeding straight away to Brongway, Brongway quarter of the Brongway village, and Batibo subdivision, and Momo division, Norway region of Cameroon, Norway region. We are proceeding at this juncture to the village straight away.